You it is good yo it's your boy Ty back here with another video and in this video today guys we're gonna be doing a gameplay of the new Galaxy Opal Jaden McDaniels in NBA 2K22 my team. Now if you guys were wondering why Jaden wasn't in packs, he's available in this locker code, which if you do get Jaden or Kemba, they do sell for a decent amount. So make sure you type this lock code in. I typed it in, did it last night. I didn't happen to get Jaden. I think I got some like diamond shoe pack or something else. But Jaden McDaniels is now home and you guys know I'm a massive Timberwolves fan. And I'm excited to use this card. Jaden here's 6'9", 185 pounds, 93 three ball, 95 driving a 90 ball handle, 87 block, 88 steal, 89 perimeter interior, 92 offensive and defensive rebounding speed, and a 90 lateral quickness at an 88. Tendency wise, 95s across the board, 25 out of famers, catch shoot, quarter specialist, ankle breaker, rim clamps, and interceptor, intimidator, posterizer, rebound, limitless range, handles for days, quick first step of buckle, sniper, menace, as well as 41 gold badges, which is just absolutely absurd. 66 base badges. Badges you might want to apply to them, unstrippable, dimer, maybe some badges like that for Jaden in general. McDaniels does not look like this, man. 2K, figure your game out. Why do players not look like they look in real life? It's it's just, give him his give him his leg thing. Give him I don't even know what it's called. Uh, the it's like a half leg sleeve, like a shin sleeve. Give him that, man. Give him his shooting sleeve. Make Jaden look like he does in real life. It's just sad. If 2K can't even do that, bro, they don't deserve to, to for for us to spend money on packs. And it is just that simple. Nonetheless, I do like how Jaden is feeling in my team. Okay, I know he doesn't look like he should, and that's a problem. My team's got... I don't care, my team. Hire a part-time employee to get this figured out, dog. I'll do it, man. Pay me $100 a week, and I will get these players actively looking like they should in my team. It's not a hard concept. 2K just has to figure it out in general. It's actually not a hard concept, man. They've just got to figure it out. Kobe sides up escape. Obviously looking very solid in my team. Release-wise, guys, it's like the Siakam base on very quick, which is very solid. Normal leaner as well. Check out the dunk packages for Jaden. He's a high flyer. Now, he does kind of have that skinny player build, but he looks long and lengthy. And I'm excited to use him here on current gen as well. Look at it, Jaden here on current gen. Expect a lot of the same, okay, guys? Decent movement. I can't sit here and say it's, you know, the best in the game, but decent movement release-wise is fine. He reminds me a lot of that Opal Pascal Siakam, okay? Or Dark Matter Siakam, I think it was, right? But Siakam obviously can play the two. Jaden can't, but I mean, that's really what he's reminding me of, okay? Just a decent enough release. Got to be able to hold it down defensively. And at the three, guys, you know, he's he's a little pricey, guys. What did I what did I spend? 40,000 MT. But if you do get him out of the locker code, he's basically free. And for a free card, guys, Jaden is looking really solid. Obviously, you can obviously sell him. He's auctionable. But is he worth selling? Or should you hold on to him? That's what we're going to be discussing in this video. The hard part is we know we got guys like Opal Danny Ferry in the game. And that's the hard part, right? We already know we've got very solid options at the three. And so Jaden's got to be that next level good, which he's looking really solid. We're going to hop into a game of my team unlimited and Jaden is going to guard ball. My opponent honestly does have a decent enough team in my team. I mean, Pierce at the three is something I nah, wouldn't necessarily recommend. But outside of that, guys, we got Kemba Walker. He's trolling. He's trolling. Anytime, I'm sorry, but anytime, oh yeah, Jaden. Anytime I see Kemba Walker on the court, it's troll. I'm confused because Jaden was fine on the point guard and y'all decided to switch back for what? What was the reason behind that? I don't know. Oh yeah, I knew you would jump in. Jaden gets an easy one. Y'all good? Come here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. You love Shaq and Jaden, and he knocks that one down right there. Come on. Look at his player build. It is ridiculous. It's not going to get hyped up, but it is ridiculous. I promise you it is. Can y'all give me a legit stop one time? 
Oh yeah, Jaden. Of course it's you. Can y'all tell me what's going on, please? Can y'all please just tell me what's going on? Just dunk the ball, KG. I'm tired of whatever's going on. That's us, that's us, that's us. It's gotta be us, man. Who wants a Krabby Patty at 3 in the morning? Oh boy, 3 a.m. <laughs> oh my gosh. Nah, Jaden might be it, man. That move is tough. Board. Board. Good. Run. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. You leaving him again? Chill. Oh, yeah, KG. Oh, yeah, KG. Sometimes it doesn't always have to look pretty. My whole thing is, y'all really think Paul Pierce's release is that bad? Flop and being weird, bro. You're being weird. Nice shot, bozo. How about you green next time? How about you green next time? How about you green next time? Oh, yeah, Jaden. Oh, yeah, Jaden. You're good. Good. Great defense. Great defense. Look at Jaden go. We're running, too. Always be unselfish. Always. I know you got Shard Badge, but there's no reason to force, man. Always be unselfish. Make that extra pass even when you don't think you got to. Oh, yeah. I guess, bro. I guess the way you want to play D is lame, but Jaden's got 11 and 5 right now. It's lame. The way you're playing D is lame, but it is what it is. Uh-oh. This is good defense, too. What you doing? What you doing? Nah, you thought you were doing something. Oh, Jaden... Oh, man, not on Jaden. You got to know better. Everybody want to sit here and slander the dude. I'm not going to, man. Pierce is not bad in my team. Jaden, though. Jaden, man. That, his, is it just me or is his release quicker than Siakam's? Easy one for Big Yao. And that's the thing. He's trying to... He, the defense he plays is weird. As long as you green the shot here, you're done. Watch this. He's not even guarding him. Whatever, bro. My opponent not even playing the game anymore. But y'all saw what I saw in Jaden McDaniel. 16, 6 assists, 2 steals, 2 blocks. The defensive end, that's where he's going to be at his best. 6, 7 from the field, 4, 5 from the 3-point line. Is Jaden McDaniels worth his price of 40,000 MT? Probably not. Okay, he's probably not worth that price. But is Jaden McDaniels really solid in my team? And can you use the card? Absolutely. That's how high I am on Jaden. If you get the card right now, I, I probably would sell him, I mean, for 40,000 MT. Just because 40,000 MT is a lot of MT for the current time we're in. If he gets around 20,000, that's where I think Jaden McDaniels is worth his price. So that is my final opinion on Jaden. I might just keep the card because I'm a big Timberwolves fan. But if I'm you guys, again, I'm selling him unless he gets to a little bit cheaper option. It's gonna wrap it up for my video today, guys. Hopefully you did enjoy it. Drop a like on the video. Subscribe if you are new and as always, man. I love you guys. Have a blessed day.